Hi everyone, it's Nicola here from Officiums. So today we're going to be looking at um, a couple of little nice features within Side Zero, the accounting package. So for those of us that are in business, we're probably going to be invoicing our clients and they're going to be paying us some promptly, some not so promptly. And that's just the nature of what happens when you invoice uh, people. Sometimes you have some really switched on customers that are really quick and pay us right away. And sometimes they're just a little bit more slower. So this is a nice feature um, that's with Inside Zero that um, I'm seeing as a bookkeeper kind of quite underutilized. Uh, and it takes away that um, kind of added pressure of one thinking, oh, you XYZ hasn't paid or, you know, I invested you last week and now you're out of terms. And just avoiding those, you know, phone calls that we all just love to do when we're chasing money. Um, so this is just a nice little prompt with Inside Zero that is a nice kicking off point in regards to reminding customers that they need to pay. So on the business tab and then our invoices here, I've just got uh, opened up on all. So up on the top right hand side here, we've got um, invoice reminders is off. So with a little alarm clock on it. So at the moment, the feature is turned off. So when you click on it, it opens up our next windows here and it says, let's us follow up on overdue invoices for you. So once we click the email customers when an invoice is, you get the option of seven days, 14, 21. So those are the standards that Xero have put in there. And as you can see, you can edit that and it lets you alter it to what the best fit is for how you may be set up. So you may ultimately be on 30 days from invoice or you may be five days or you know whatever whatever system you have currently in place for how long your um your uh, invoice payment period is and of course you can personalize it in here as well um you know and make it a bit more user friendly and just put your own touch on it and obviously your signature as well there so once you've made all your changes uh you just save it and once we head down the bottom here, we've got um, include a link to the invoice, which probably be standard just in case someone's forgot to pay it. They can click on it and see what they've got to do. Um, and there's a little option here for don't send reminders out owing on an invoice for under $1. So that may have just been a keying error, someone's uh, left a part payment open for that amount or whatever. But obviously you can change that at will or you can just untick the box and not worry about that at all. And um, you go save and the system will automatically, when an invoice falls due, it will automatically send out reminders to your clients that haven't paid. So one thing that I did see um, recently on a forum, which kind of prompted me to make this uh, video, was that someone had put the invoice reminders on, and then they consequently got a a little bit of a, uh, a few upset clients that were going, why am I getting reminders of paying my invoice? I always pay my invoice on time, which is fair enough. You don't want to upset customers that are the good payers. And you don't want the system automatically chucking out an invoice for um, clients that just are really good and really regular. They may be set up on an automatic payment or you just may know that they're going to pay, but they pay once a fortnight on a Friday and it's never a hassle. You always get paid. So you definitely don't want to be upsetting those lovely customers that kind of are on the ball. So what you can do with actually inside the invoice without turning this off and sort of losing the feature for everybody else that may be a bit slower, you can personalize the um, invoice in that when you go into your client, so it may be ABC Furniture. When you actually go into the contact card, um, under options here on the right hand side, you can go to and off invoice reminders, which is quite cool. So you can go through and kind of go, oh yep, I know, Joe's Trading are going to pay, and I know, you know, ABC Furniture are going to pay. So what you do is go into the contact, go up to options, turn off invoice reminders, and then this particular supplier won't be sent those automatic emails if the invoice falls due uh, with the automatic reminder. So it still lets you utilize the invoice follow-up 
reminder um, feature which is very cool but you can personalize it and then just take out those people the good payers that don't need to be prompted by a, you know a reminder and possibly upset them which you don't want to do obviously as a good client so that's just a little um, kind of tip and trick um, this time round out of zero and I hope that was helpful guys and if you've got any other requests that you need me to do a video on then please just shoot me a message or drop me a line by, by cost, uh, commenting on this video and I'm more than happy to do something for you. Okay, until next time, take care. Thanks very much.